Yo, a task. I'm very excited to watch this. So I have an emulator window open and I was given the FM2 file of the Goomba Shoe run. Pop quiz. Does anyone know what the Goomba Shoe is actually called? Yes, you must know. This is created by Tompa and it is 100% all technical levels beaten. So a good example of that is that the Goomba Shoe does not swim in water. In World 7 level 4, the water auto scroller level rises up as you go through the auto scroller, you know, the sea creatures, and then it goes through the Gelectrode part. So that level is going to be skipped, but it is essentially 100% completion of possibilities. This could actually be uh, pretty silly or pretty fun to watch. All right, I'm very excited. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and turn down FCUX here. Just a little bit, there you go. This is everyone's dream right now. First of all, even though this isn't a crazy impressive task, I still wanna watch someone beat the game with a frog suit. Or sorry, not the frog suit, the Goomba shoot. All right, level three secret. All right, do it again. And there's like, there's not really a whole lot of like knowledge that I can add by. <laughs> I love how the Goomba shoe slides on the ground as it finishes the level. I don't think there is a massive amount of technicality that I could share with you all when it comes to the Goomba shoe. I know the Goomba shoe is, um, it doesn't really have weird physics. It's kind of the same as normal Mario, but there's a few things. Number one, oh my God, what? Okay, hold on. The, the auto scrollers are gonna be really fun. So one thing to note, you're probably wondering how the Goomba shoe is doing all these weird things. It looks like he's floating. The Goomba shoe can actually, oh my God. Nice, nice shell jump. The Goomba Shoe has technically, not technically a double jump. If you bounce off of a platform, the, game, the Goomba Shoe has not registered any kind of jumps yet. So you can jump whenever you want. So as you can see, he's gonna bounce off the ledge. So he jumped there, but he's gonna bounce off, well, no. I tried to explain it so you guys could see it. What about right here? Nope, didn't do it. But anyways, when the Goomba Shoe is like walking normally, it like bounces up and down, right? It bounces up and down. If you go off the side of a ledge, when it bounces, oh my God, look at the Goomba Shoe, it's a different color. But if you go off the ledge, when the Goomba Shoe bounces, you can jump whenever you want, essentially. Also, the Goomba Shoe does kill those. What? Okay, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Yo, the like black and yellow shoe there. Yeah, look, the black and white shoe, the Nikes. Yeah, so right there, right there, Tompa did a double jump. Well, I guess a mid-air jump, sorry, not double. <laughs> yes, the Goomba Shoe Tunnel, I like it, I love it. All right, is Tompa gonna have to do the elevator of shame here, the ride of shame? Yep. So right there, that's how Tompa is able to fall off the platform and then jump. You see that? The Goomba Shoe slides. Yep. If you hold forward and then neutral on the Goomba Shoe, some momentum gets kept and it slides across the ground a little bit. Whoa! The Goomba Shoe is brown in here. I was not expecting that. Dumb question. You can't do this manually. No. So Tompa had... Whoa, that was weird. So Tompa definitely had to create... Um, a ROM hack that allowed him to have the Goomba Shoe all the time. I'm assuming if he takes damage here, he'll just instantly have the Goomba Shoe back again. I don't know if he's gonna take damage or not. So we'll see. He is gonna farm lives though. Hmm. I wonder why no mushroom. I wonder not, what, cause you can still get fire. Whoa, you can still get fireballs and shoot them in the Goomba Shoe. Curious. Maybe you can't? Oh my god, the Goomba Shoe is so weird. Don't tell me. What? Oh my god, look at Mario's color right there. Look at him. If I take a mushroom, I can no longer clip through narrow gaps. So that's that's something to, to consider. So 
So this might be the slowest, fastest speed run. But it's the Goomba Shoe. How could you not like the Goomba Shoe? Are we going to get early hammer here? I don't think so, right? No, this is still 100%. All right, so this is going to maybe show us that um, you sink in water. Nope. No. Not gonna show us. But if you notice, when he stomped on the Koopas, they actually died. They didn't they didn't just go into their shell and then in the water. Okay, here we go. Very close to that thwomp, no need. One cool thing about the Goomba shoe. Oh, that's sick! Wait, what? How the hell did you get P speed there? You haven't got P-Speed anywhere else. The only way I can get P-Speed with Goomba Shoe is getting P-Speed and then jumping into the Goomba Shoe. That's the only way that I know how. Yo, Star Strat, you've learned, Toppa, you know. Oh my god, the star with the Goomba Shoe looks so weird. So, what I think he needs, I think Toppa... Oh yeah, because... That's right! Yeah! You, you have to do that! That's right, because you kill the Koopas, you can't throw them. Oh, dude, I love how that works out perfectly. That's incredible, that just works out. Wait, can you kill the sun with the Goomba Shoe? I don't think so. Tampa would kill the sun if he could, so I'm going to assume that he can't. <laughs> yeah, number five. Dude, I love that the Goomba Shoe changes palette color too. That puts like, that that creates so much more character for this actual run. This is something we all needed to see. Wait, can the Goomba Shoe not stomp the boomerang? Did you try that, Tompa? Oh, shucks, that sucks. Boom, boom. So the reason why the Goomba Shoe, why the Goomba Shoe changes color there is because like it shares color palettes with the uh, the chest, and they never expected you. Oh, you have to. That's right. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Okay, so this was the one level that is impossible with the Goomba Shoe, and since he doesn't have a cloud yet, he can't. Again, I honestly think my favorite part is the Goomba Shoe colors changing to <laughs> the crank on the Goomba Shoe, like it's a toy. How did you not get hit there? Like, I just don't get it. What? When you're tasking stuff like this, Tompa, do you sometimes, like, you're like, I can't believe I survived there. I can't believe that works. Like, you try it a couple times and you die, and then you, like, keep trying it to see if you can survive, right? But then when you survive, you're like, oh my god, I can't believe that works. What? Like that, right there. Like, what? Come on, man. What? That was like, that was like the weird moonwalk. I feel like Mario's cycling through the stages of Tetris, like the colors, the same color palette that Tetris uses. All right, I've been in the Goomba shoe in this water level, so I am curious. Oh, you wall jump. I didn't know you could do that. Why are you so fast in the water? I guess because your normal speed in water and it looks weird, right? So he used like the current out of the pipe. That was crazy. Oh, you wanted it. You wanted the P speed. Wait, what? Why were you balancing on the water there? Is that necessary, Tompa? If you jump with the boot when you just enter the water, you can avoid resetting your speed to zero. That's pretty good for speedrunning. That was really smart! That, okay, I give you props for that. Yo, Goomba Shoe Door 3 though? Couldn't possibly be it. No way. 
No goo machine door three, right? Oh yeah. How hard was door three to task there? I bet it was really tough. You are one lucky bug. Nice. I wish for those Hammer Brothers setups in my 100% run, that would be the, the most fun. All right. Okay. Did you just corner clip that Delectrode? Okay, that is cool. I don't care what anyone says. How do you get so much height out of the water? You, ju you, you jumped once. What? Actually, I've gone through blocks like that before. Hold on a sec, hold on a sec. I need to get a Red Bull. Am I missing crazy stuff? All hail the Red Koopa. Tompa, can I rewind this video? What? Okay. Uh, dude, I love the water levels. I think the water levels are the best part of this task, for sure. Yo, are you getting super swim with the Goomba shoe? I don't know how you don't do any slowdowns. 3-9 is another impossible level. It's because when you go in the water, you die, right? You also can't do any grab blocks. Is it the grab blocks or the water? Yeah. I could have sworn there was ground in the water transition. <laughs> yes! What the hell was that? I don't understand how you don't take damage there. All right, Wendy. Oh my God, look at your shoe. That hot, bright red. <laughs> if only you were the Goomba shoe here. Yeah. This is, whoa, that was close. This level can definitely snipe you with the fish though. Oh look, perfect hammer brothers. All right, I have a weird feeling that this level is not going to be as cool as the speed run. And I think I'm right. Definitely not as cool as the way it looks when you speed run. But have you ever wondered what would Mario 3 look like if you could keep the Goomba shoe? Well, this is what it would look like. All right, so I assume you have to neutral to go through the one tile. I assume you're gonna like kind of slide through it, right? Oh no, you set up your bounces to, I see. I thought you could only get in front of that thwomp with P-Speed. What? Does that happen in every Boom Boom battle? You quickly change? <laughs> MFP gift MFP High Alice 5 arrived. Go, go Goomba Shoe, go! Go, go, aw, oh, nice. Yo, Alice, thank you very much and welcome back. 25 months. Hey, I had this Hammer Brothers set up today. Is the same thing gonna happen to you that happened to me? I sure hope so. Nope, that's what I was hoping for. Nothing to do, nothing to do in the level, right, Tompa? Once you get the Goomba Shoe, that's it. Fortress first. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, I was really hoping you were gonna go in that door and do something. So let me see if every boom boom removes the shoe right at the end. Oh, it does. Okay. I didn't notice that before. You're like, screw that. I'm going on the top. I'm not staying at the bottom. What? 
You see the plants when they die? They turn into like weird Koopa shells. Yeah, the midair jump with the Goomba shoe is very, very uh, simple. It's There's nothing to it. Just You just have to make sure you bounced off the edge. So fire, those fire things you can destroy if they shoot right. But if they shoot left, you can't stop them. That's so weird. You can stop up, up and down ones though. Guys, I've been live for four hours and 20 minutes. I wonder if... <laughs> Wait, you got P-Speed. Yeah! Do you keep it? This must have been really annoying to keep. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. Don't tell me you get a pipe clip. No, it's gone. No, you still have it. Ah, oh, no pipe clip. That's okay, though. That was still... Yo, this Goomba shoe is the best looking one so far. Yeah, best best color palette so far, hands down. Pimp my Goomba shoe. Let's go. All right, world five. I wonder if you're gonna swap swap out this Goomba shoe for a new one. Five three. Whee! Nice. Yeah, even though, like I said before, this isn't the most like entertaining task we've ever seen, but this is one we needed. All right, here we go. This is what I was talking about. We're gonna get the wall jumps. Yeah. Yep, I knew that was gonna happen. Cause I've done that with the Goomba shoe before, but only the Goomba shoe. Wow, it's just a few frames faster to do that trick anyways. That's crazy. All right, doing 5-3 in the Goomba shoe task is like when movies say the name of the movie in the movie. So I'm very excited for us to enter 5-3. It's, it's, it's gonna feel like home, you know? So naturally you can't keep this Goomba shoe like through levels or get it in any other levels. What happened, this is for pure entertainment value because we've all wondered since we've been little what it'd be like to play the game with the, with the Goomba shoe. So a ROM hack was made that allows you to have the Goomba shoe in every level. And then Tompa decided he wanted to task it and see what it looks like when you beat the whole game with the Goomba shoe. <gasps> what? Goomba shoe murder! Goomba shoe murder! Killing a Goomba shoe with a Goomba shoe is, is forbidden. That is frowned upon. I never thought I'd see it. At least there's a little bit more to do in this little sequence, right? You can... <laughs> yeah, all right, you're just gonna go back and forth. I feel like you've broken maybe like four blocks in this run so far. Yeah, this is... Oh, the Goomba shoe looks sick. How did you get so high up there? I don't understand. Yes, this is sick. Look at this. How did you get so high in the air? Yeah, you're flying up there. I don't get how you got up there. That was sick, though. Ah, you didn't have fully optimized Hammer Brother positions, Mr. Tompa. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. Tompa got a movement of three! Tompa got a movement of three! Yo- Oh, dude! The Goomba shoes with the beetle! The best! You think the black and white shoe? Yo, Fall Rose! Thank you very much for the three gift subs. Dude, you still haven't got a mushroom yet at all. I guess it's just not- Oh my god, what? I guess it's just not, like, optimal at all. There's, like, no places. You wouldn't be able to have as fun, though, that's true. I'd be so scared right now. Oh, what's- you didn't get the death? You didn't get the random pipe squish? So, there's no extra coding whatsoever in the Goomba shoe for this task. So the Goomba shoe is naturally programmed. Like, you can do this with the normal Goomba shoe in Mario 3 if you load it up right now. There's no way you get the clip here. Yeah, nice try. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Unfortunately, I know a little too much about this game. 
that we could not get the Jesus clip, mainly because of speed restrictions and size restrictions. Sorry. Yo, there was a corner boost. I saw that corner boost. This is a great example to show you how you like midair jump. Tampa is clipping all the time in the Goomba shoe, just like not the not the corner clip where you zip through the wall. So a lot of people misinterpret like wall jumps and corner clips as like different things when they're the they're the exact same thing. Like when I clip 7-1, I'm standing on the exact same pixel that I would if I were setting up for a wall jump. Like on like for an off-screen wand grab. I need to hit a pixel in the wall so that I can jump, right? Well, 7-1 and corner clips work the same way, except I'm ducking and I hit the wall jump pixel and I stand up and that's what zips me through. So, Tampa is clipping all the time in the walls here, constantly. He's constantly wall jumping, constantly hitting the, the pixels. Unfortunately, he's not big enough to corner clip like 7-9s or 7-1s. He doesn't have enough speed to clip 7-7 seven, seven either. He only has enough speed and his size for wall jumps, essentially. So you're gonna see a 6-9 wall jump. You will probably see a 7-1 clip Maybe, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna see one. The 7-1 is just a little bit finicky, right? It's not your normal corner clip. There's like that extra leeway of pixels in the block. Oh, this Goomba shoe is like the Wendy one. The bright red, it's like, it's like candy red. Oh, 6-1, this level was so nice to me today. Can't you get P-Speed with ice? If you... Keep like tapping, like neutral tap, neutral tap. Did you already try that? Oh, here's the question. Does Tampa, does Tampa kill the Red Koopa? It's very important. What kind of person is Tampa right now? I'll hail Red Koopa. No! Where are you going? What the heck? kept him alive! Did you actually keep him alive because of All Hail Red Koopa? Please tell me you did. Yes! All Hail Red Koopa! Tompa's my guy now. Tompa's dope. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Watch, he's just gonna go. Yeah. Yeah, I knew. Yeah! What? Okay, I wasn't expecting it to be that crazy. I thought you were just gonna go to the wall and scale the side of the wall, but no. No way you make it. What? Did you have to corner boost to make it? Would you have made it if you didn't corner boost? No, you had to corner boost. That's crazy. Hey, your Goomba shoe changed color. Or wait, was your Goomba shoe white on the first level too? I don't remember. Still looks cool though. Yo, any Fire Flower fanfares? All right, here's another level where we're gonna get um, the spinners. Nice. All right, another, I love the water levels with the Goomba shoe. You sink so fast because of the water. How did you not clip into the ceiling by accident? Like come to a dead stop. You were like so deep in that ceiling, what the hell? What do we do here? Do we skip this next level? What, do we skip it? What do we do here? We skip it, right? Yep, okay. What? I totally forgot about that donut block there. Like, I know you're not gonna die, but it still gets me. I don't, I don't, I know you're not gonna die. Did you try that one time, Tampa, and you went through it? There's no way you didn't, right? <laughs> Just going in circles. All right, this is the good stuff. Nice, I like. <laughs> Wait, it kills both of them? When you have the two death waffles, like the roto discs or whatever they're called, they're spinning. 
and you kill one of them, it kills both of them? I guess that's true. When you do ROM hacking, when you ROM hack this game, you don't put one in. You don't like drag one in like Mario Maker or something. You put in the actual like center thing and then it, ha it has the thing whether it's like one or two. So I guess that makes sense. Yo, you got, did you go up through that one up? You went up through that one up. Yay, wall jump! Whee! So when Tasser's wall jump, they always go left. Is it because you want to get speed and go around? RTA runners never do that. Yo, it's our white Nikes. Our white Nikes are back. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait for him. Yep, I knew it was coming. So that you can clip now. Yeah, what? The Goomba shoe clip. That is cool. That is fucking cool. I'm I'm happy now. My life is complete. All right, we got corner clips. We got wall jumps. We got off-screen wall grabs. We have gray Goomba shoes. We have seen all the colors of the rainbow when it comes to Goomba shoe. All right, what color is this boss? It's, it's like a green shell, right? So you're just gonna get a green shoe? Ah, yes. That color I've seen before. Yeah, you had to go fast there. You were running out of time. The moment we've all been waiting for. Does Tompa 7-1 this? If he doesn't, that's cool because we get to see 7-1 Goomba Shoe, which is really cool. But if he does, that is also cool because I don't think you can, but I don't see why you can't. I don't see why you can't. I mean, you're not tall enough as Big Mario, but you're tall enough. Goomba shoe clip. Okay, so at least now I know it's probably impossible. But at least we get to see seven. Yeah, look at this. Wall jumping everywhere. Oh, this level's cool. Look at this. Boom. 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 Wall jump. Oh my god. That's crazy. Wall jump right here. Boom. Boom. Okay, I like. I like. I'm happy with that. And because you have the Goomba shoe, you can just clear the gap, right? You can just clear this gap, I think. Yes, you can. You did the enemy boost that you just you just told me about. Pipe the pipe? Nah, you could just jump anyways. That's funny though. Okay. No star. We don't need a star. You wanna know what's crazy about this level? This level's really hard if you go slow. I've noticed that going when you go really fast in this level It's actually not that hard because like everything kind of like lines up for like big jumps Both 7-4 and 7-5 are impossible so those levels go bye-bye Wait, I've clipped into that pipe so many times, I've never seen that before. I've never seen you disappear in that. Yo, this is gonna be sick. Oh, you can't make it? So close. Sick! Dude, that looks so cool, man. I love the way that looks. That's the shit I live for. Somebody needs to make an all vertical level task and then Goomba Shoe it all. Wall jumps are much easier in the Goomba Shoe as well. Nice try, Tompa. You can't trick me. Oh yeah, we don't need the stars either. Not that they make you faster. That's another thing. Uh, for anyone who hasn't played Mario 3 in a long time, who has been playing a lot more of the modern games. In Mario 1 and Mario 3 and Mario 2, stars do not give you extra speed. That wasn't something that they didn't introduce until the Mario games until, what, like 3D Land, New Super Mario Brothers, Mario Galaxy, right? Those are the games where if you get a star, Nice. 
That is true, Super Mario Kart. Is it Super Mario Kart 64? Oh, the grab blocks in the previous level. Yo, your clouds work out perfectly here. That's crazy. Get wrecked, Pipe Fortress. Nice. Timing the bounces perfectly so they go under is so cool. I love it. Well, I guess if you didn't have enough clouds, you could get one extra cloud from 3-7, right? But yeah, that, that works out perfectly. Ah, 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 nice try. Yeah, Tava, how did you disappear here? That I get, that I understand, you can do that. Depends on the Y position of the screen. The Goombish is gonna be like green and white here, right? For this boss. Man, I want you to get a power up so bad. You keep dancing around though. I was like, here's the time, man. He's getting a power up now. No, I don't think you get a single power up. Maybe in the last fortress, but I don't think so because you can't get under the spikes. Yo, can you imagine you stomp Bowser with a Goomba shoe? No way. Can you? There we go. We got a clip. Oh man, I was I was way off with the Goomba shoe colors. We got poo poo brown and like what turquoise. That's kind of that's is that teal or turquoise? The turd turd coys, like turds. Insta clip at the start of the ship. I'm gonna create a ROM hack that every time you stomp on something, it says "ow." I'm gonna figure out how to get the NES to properly have that recording. Ow! Tampa tricked me there, of course. Don't even pretend like you're gonna get it, Tampa. I know you're not. It's like the poisonous mushroom from like Super Mario World Kaizo hacks and stuff. What? You went right through that rocky wrench. What? What? You still got it? Why is it so easy for the Goomba shoe to clip, man? No. Nope. What's the matter? You couldn't get Wrangless? It's a little too hard, I bet. All right. Are you gonna go for a swim? Yeah. Oh, here we go. What, you went through like five bullets? What? Okay, that was some weird shit. Both those bullets crisscrossed right through you. No clip yet. I don't think you need P-Speed to get the clips in this stage though, right? It's gonna do it anyways. How did you like stop yourself there? Can you press down in the Goomba shoe? You know, I dream about the days where I could run under the fireballs so I can get P speed. The black, white, and green Goomba shoe. <laughs> you take any path that makes us sweat, man. No hands so far, he hasn't got pulled in by any. Gee. That was like the most boring level we've ever watched. But I love it. I love it because it's all Goomba Shoe. Alright, here we go. Alright, was not expecting that right away. Are all the flames shooting right here? I think they are because they're like supposed to act like the engine or the, you know what I mean? Like the, the rockets. The housing unit for the fuel. Whoa! Can you imagine you actually added in like a death in here just for the jokes? The task finally died. Yo, the cross, the cross screen, 100 points. This is probably one of my favorite tasks. All right. I wonder if you're gonna be able to get P-Speed in the little area. It's not a one tile, but maybe it's low enough? No. No, 
the Goomba shoe is very slow, so would the pipe sand be faster? I don't think so. No, it is faster. Is it faster? I mean, you'd already be through the sand by now. Oh yeah, it's faster. Oh, just, yeah, because of that right there. Out of my way, Mr. Sun. What do we got here? Oh! Clever thinking! I, I, I instantly, I was like, oh yeah, how's he supposed to break through? That was cool, man. Yeah, that was. That was very clever. You're not gonna make the first P-Switch cycle. Wow, you can really go far there with that slide. I clearly saw you corner flip with the spike. How did that not work? We are gonna take the ad break at Bowser's Castle. That's right, it's the perfect time, right at the end, right before Bowser. And I really gotta go pee, too. Let me pee! Speed. Let me pee speed. Here we go. World 8. I wonder if the Goomba Shoe's gonna change when you, when you see Bowser. I can't remember if it does. Look at how crisp... Look at how crisp tat, like, emulators are and stuff. I knew that was gonna happen, cause you can do the single block flips, it works. Ah, oh, no Goomba Shoe change from Bowser. So because Tomp is in the Goomba Shoe, I don't think he can sit under Bowser. Oh, right down in there, that's funny. Yeah! We saved it, we saved Peach with the Goomba Shoe. So the final time is one hour and eight minutes and one second. A few things to note, yes, some parts are boring, I agree, but some parts are really cool. The world does need this. So yeah, it was really fun to watch. I loved the Goomba shoe colors changing. Never seen that before in my life. So the water stages are my favorite. Saving the red Koopa, that was definitely a highlight. That is the Mario 3 Goomba shoe 100% task completed by Tampa. I hope you all enjoyed it. Woo. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you really enjoyed my content, do not forget to subscribe. It helps me out so, so much. Thank you all for watching.